I do think here's the thing with with and they wrote about this in their book. The young bucks really like and respect and had a good time dealing with Triple H, Paul Levesque. Okay, but at the time Paul was not in charge, and you know how Vince was with tag teams. So you know the right, the easy decision was to was to go to AEW, and now here we are, and it's 2023, and here's the thing that we all know. Okay, if there's one thing we know for sure about WWE is we don't know what's going on, okay? So do you remember when uh do you remember when all those guys wanted out because of Vince and then Triple H showed up and they all wanted back? Well, now we don't Triple H could be gone tomorrow. Triple H could be gone after WrestleMania. I mean, yeah, Vince showed up to visit with uh John Cena. And then just happened to sit at Gorilla all night. I mean, I think we all know uh, the dude could be back fully in charge literally at any time. Maybe he will, maybe he won't. We don't know. But, you know, I if I were the Bucks and I was a tag team and I had young children and I was making a lot of money and I had to work a, one day a week, bro, this is an easy decision for me. I'd rather stay with AEW. Kenny Omega? I don't know. He's a single. You know, even even when Vince was in charge, Cody Rhodes walked in to a main event. He walked in as a main eventer. He's main eventing WrestleMania. And, you know, if, if Vince hadn't left, all the same thing was going to happen. I mean, he was still going to main event WrestleMania. He was still going to be a giant star. So, you know, Kenny Omega, he probably has the opportunity to walk in and be a top guy and make a tremendous amount of money. So, you know, I don't know what everyone's going to decide. I don't know what everyone's going to decide. If I had to wager a guess, because people have asked, been asking me all these different things, like, where do you think this guy's going? Where do you think that guy's going? I have, let me, let me make this abundantly clear before you write stories. I have no inside information. But if you ask me what I think, which is different from what I know, what I think is the Young Bucks would prefer to stay with AEW. Kenny Omega, I would say it's 50-50. And uh, Jay White, I believe, is going to WWE. These are all, this is all what I think, but it's not what I know. So we'll see what happens. But Loading up on some liquid energy here. Uncle Howdy. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? <laughs> That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. Why does he do that? me to explain Uncle Howdy. Yes. Somebody needs to put that to music, some 70s song, for the best of the Brian and Vinny show. Yeah, keep it off this show, please. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. We're going to get kicked off whatever run. You just disgusted Granny. That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. What a jamming song that is. Yeah, keep it off this show, please. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of the Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, the Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.